Applying for UK visa from outside the UK Those applicants desiring to apply for a United Kingdom visa from outside the United Kingdom time and again face problems trying to find a way through the heap of visa application submission methods. Have you visited our website? We have hundreds of updates regarding UK visa and immigrations. Also, if you haven't subscribed the channel, please subscribe now, and press the bell icon, to get the latest updates on your screens. It is basically a two-step process, beginning with submitting an application online via the official website guf.uk, and concluding by submitting the obligatory credentials and biometrics through one of the Home Office's subcontracted partners, VFS Global or TLS Contact. This blog will be aiming on the second step of the process, starting by observing at which countries these Home Office's subcontracted partners function and describing how they operate. Later, when the visa application is uploaded and fee paid online via gov.uk website the applicant will be pointed to either VFS Global or TLS contact, varying on which nation the application is being submitted from. A complete record of all countries and the subcontracted partner running in each can be found on our website. The process for submitting obligatory credentials and biometric information in the second step of the submission procedure is usually alike across both stages and is as follows. Book an appointment at the applicant's adjoining visa center. Decide among self-uploading documents to the gov.uk online document portal, or otherwise depositing a fee to have your credentials scanned for you when you appear at your appointment at the visa center. Upload the obligatory documents to the online document portal, if self-uploading. Appear at the appointment at the visa center to provide biometrics and, if not self-uploading, to have documents scanned. Return to Visa Center to collect passport after verdict has been made by UK Visa and Immigrations. Although this is the general process followed in most countries, many countries have methods or traits limited to them. Other countries just do not have the amnesties to operate a visa application center, obliging a possible applicant to travel to another country for their appointment. To add to the mix-up, VFS Global and TLS Contact operate very unusual-looking websites each with its own processes and directions which often clash with out-of-date information on the gov.uk website. If the visa applicant is in disbelief about which process to follow in their country, they should assess the VFS Global and TLS contact website for the latest update.